It's Dr. Robin B, and I'm here at the charity gala for Future Stars. Tonight we're going to celebrate just all the work they're doing with the camp, and it's going to be a great night of giving back. And you know I'm here with Young, Bold, and Regal. Three. Evan Jackson here with Young, Bold, and Regal, and we're here with... He's Sophie Taylor. What's so great about you talking about financial literacy is that we see with you talking to it with your daughters. So what are, you, what, are, what are some things that you're teaching your daughters about building generational wealth, not only for their generation, but for their future kids as well? I think the most important thing to recognize as it relates to uh, building generational wealth is that trading time for dollars is a game you can't win. So it's not how much you make per hour or how much you make for your effort, but it's really having your money working for you, right? Your money doesn't get sick, your money doesn't get tired, it doesn't need to go on vacation, it can work and work and work. And that's really what I want to impart to my children. Tell us more about this gala you have. Last year I heard about it and it's incredible and now it's expanded even more. Talk about also your philanthropy and your giving back. Yeah, I truly believe that givers get. Um, I'm, I have a servant's heart and uh, the game of basketball has meant so much to me in my life um, and I'm just trying to give back. So the children that we're able to help and support not only on the basketball court but in the school, right, in the, in the school uh, classroom as well, it's, it's, uh, it's so amazing to be a part of this and, 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 and build, this, uh, build this organization up. And you, you're a financial advisor to a lot of people who have a lot of big money portfolios, but also a lot of big stars. What is one question that's often asked where it kind of takes you aback where you're like, whoa, maybe they didn't know this. This is where I could guide them in. I think one of the biggest misnomers when you're dealing with really successful people is that oftentimes people will mistake someone being successful with being a good planner. And those are two different things. Just because I make a lot of money doesn't mean I have great financial literacy. So I'm always taken back. Actually, some of the most successful people I've ever met have the worst planning. What's your word of advice who, for somebody who's just trying to start in that financial journey? Something incredibly simple, but it could push them very far. Again, I always say the road to walk a mile begins with a single step. It's just a matter of starting, right? And maybe that's $100, maybe it's $500, whatever it is, just start, right? The power of compounding interest is, is powerful. Take advantage. All right, team, save money, right? Save money not only for yourself, but for the next generation as well. Thank you. Thank you, sir. All right. My guy. Thank you, bro. Appreciate you. Hi, I'm Adrian Rose White, and I'm here at the Future Stars Camp Gala with Young, Bold, and Regal. Evan Jackson, Young Bolton Regal. We're here with Romeo Miller. How awesome does it feel to be here today to give back? We know you for your musical career, but honestly, me, I'd follow your basketball career. So, how does it feel? Basketball, uh, I tell people, is the game of life. Any sport, you think about it. You know, if you got a football, basketball, soccer ball, golf ball, that represents the dream. And however much time you put in it, that's what you're going to get out of it, right? You, you get on that court, whatever kind of court it is, whatever kind of field it is, you got a coach, right? That represents your parents or a parental figure. How do you navigate that? So I tell people, put your kids in sports. It's shaped leaders. You know, you don't have to become the next LeBron or Lisa Leslie, but it definitely uh, shapes you to be a, a great leader. And for me, you know, uh, basketball has always been that, that blueprint of life for me. You're all about divine intentionality. Yeah. Every step you do, every move you make, business and in life, you take it towards your d divine plan. Yeah. How are you doing that now in 2023? You know, uh, God guides you if you listen. You know, if you listen, everything happens for a reason, and you got to follow the heart. I tell people all the time, my career, it wasn't by accident. You know, it wasn't by one man, it wasn't by one woman. I've always had God, and I kept God first. They have a lot of successful people with parents, successful parents. Everybody didn't do what I accomplished. 20-plus years in this industry, you know, 150,000-plus hours, you know, catered to my craft. It's all been ordained by God. And I know it may sound cliche, but if that's your anchor, anything truly is possible. And that's why I'm here giving back today. I want those kids to know that. When they make it, you got to come back and give back to the future. And last question, we always say we come from kings and queens in our lineage, but we wanted to ask you, what makes you regal? Yeah. Man, I have to say it starts with my mama. <laughs> my mom, that's where it starts. All the moms across the world shout to y'all, me being a new dad. You know, uh, those are the real queens, and we come from them. So Evan Jackson here, Young Bolton Regal, and we're here with the amazing... Paola Pauline. 
how incredible is it to be here at this event talking about not only giving back but financial literacy knowing what to do with your money knowing how to put it in the right places and give it to the right charities as well as save it for the next generation Yes, I love this. I'm an actress, but I come from the business world. The first thing I did, I was a diplomatic. I used to work for the Colombian government, bringing investors to Colombia. So now as an actress and a producer, I use my platform first to raise awareness, to help charity, but also to educate people as a selfie does really well about financial advice. So I'm really happy. I actually was in New York filming a movie and I flew in last night just to make it to this event and giving back people honestly is where it's at and uh, the more we get the more it's, we, we give back is great right and